my experience here has been a dream come true. I feel like I've matured in so many ways. I grew up not even in the aspect that I'm a father now. It just um, I learned so many different things. I can be a voice, somebody that can lean on me. It's been a long journey because I was here from the beginning, from the transition, the year after the transition. So um, I've seen a lot, been through a lot, and I'm just glad I was a part of it. And I think what makes it so special is the people. Just being surrounded by an atmosphere of people who love you, who care about you, and people in the athletic department, and uh, really the city of Omaha. I've been here for a while, so I know everyone. I'm comfortable here, and I just know I know everything so well. And uh, jumping into something new is always scary. Whether if I still play basketball or get a job, it's going to be a little scary, but it's a challenge I'm willing to take. Basketball means a lot to the city of Omaha, and, and I think well, we're underrated, but we have a lot of talent here in Omaha, and we're just seeing it on the scene with guys who, who can really play and represent UNO and the city of Omaha. Basketball here, in my opinion, can explode if we all continue to just blossom into who we, who we can be. I feel like basketball can be big. We can turn Nebraska, Omaha, Nebraska into a, a basketball state and city. Whether you're out in public or you're around the campus or whatever, everyone notices you and recognizes you. And they just say, like, good, good game or something, or congratulations or something like that. And it's always a great feeling to have people recognize you. I want to be remembered not, not just, oh, he was the nation's leader and still at that point in time. I want to be remembered as somebody that played for the man next to him. I want to be remembered as the person that wore Omaha with pride. I think what we stand for um, is pride and hard work. Marcus works incredibly hard, trading on an Omaha guy, and similar to me, we don't expect anything. We don't uh, want things to come easy to us. We go out and get them and work for everything we have. So I hope that's our legacy here at UNO. We're just, we're, we're gonna fight and do whatever it takes for our team. And uh, I know Kyler and Tradeon, they'll do anything as well as me to uh, get a W. We don't really care about the stats. We're trying to do whatever it takes for our team to win. This, this group of seniors is so many, it's so different from what I've been used to. Like we all come from different places, but we're so similar. So um, Kyler and Marcus has become another one of my brothers in such a short period of time. They took me in and I'm, I'm grateful to have people like them in my life.